Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Okay, so in case anybody's wondering, yes, I did buy one of the Jeffree Star uh, mystery boxes. I bought the great big one. <clears throat> I did open it and look at it a while ago when I got it. But I have not shared what I got in my box. So I had quite a few things that I didn't have before. This is the mini controversy palette. And I don't know which version this is. I have to open it up and see. There are two versions of this palette. The mini version anyway. So I want to see. <gasps> yes, I got the one with the green in it. So this is the one that I like. I am not wild about the other version. So yes, can add that. I didn't like the great big controversy palette, not colors I'm gonna use, but the little one. Now the little one I like, go figure. And of course, I did get the weirdo palette. I did get that. That was one of the ones I did end up getting. So, and I have none of these. I love this packaging though. This whole gothy black and red. Me, I love black and red together. This is definitely like loving the packaging on this. <clears throat> oh my God. My voice is going to disappear on me again. <coughs> All right. And then, you know, I said I would never use the cream. I wouldn't buy the cremated palette because I would never use it. And I'm thinking about it. I'm like, maybe I will. There's Jen. Genuinely some colors in here now that I'm like really looking at it that I really would use. It's different when you like when you see it in a video and then when you see it in person. You know, it doesn't look the same. The lights and the things. So <clears throat> I'm actually going to keep this one. I think there's really only one palette of his that I have gotten that... I, you know, wouldn't really use it. That was the controversy one because I'm pretty sure I have every other one. The one thing that I did get that I have had before, this is the lip set, the red one. And I already took the colors that I wanted out of the previous one that I had and things. So that is definitely not one I will be keeping um I did get the new mirror oh I just ripped my box I have all these mirrors and I have nowhere to put them but yes I did I don't always I don't necessarily use the mirrors hardly ever like I said I have a trifold vanity mirror on my dresser so there's really no point for me to have a handheld mirror not when I can take and move my mirrors on my dresser around to get the effect that I'm looking for I can literally go like this and make a and see everything I need to see oh this the Velour Lick Scrub, the Witch's Brew. I'm not going to open this. This is definitely going away. This smells like licorice. Ugh. I hate licorice. Don't like the smell of it. It is disgusting. Black licorice. Vomit. The only place that stuff is good for is in the trash. Because, ew. Um, I got another one of the eyeliner. This is Assets. I have one of the other ones. So I was really happy that I got this because these ones are actually really nice. His, he has very nice eyeliners. 
It sucks that they're all green, but, you know, I'll still use it. I got more single shadows, tax-free, heavy-weighted, but I, these are all in the palettes that I already have. I can't remember if I only got the two. Maybe I only did get the two. Okay. Um, this is one of his luminous setting powders, luminous setting powder in rose. Um, I do not use I'm not a fan of setting powders, of loose setting powders. So this is not, and it's a luminous one. Uh, no, that's what highlighter's for, and so this is not something I will use. That's, it can go, unfortunately. I wish I liked regular lipsticks, but I don't. I prefer liquids. This is actually a really pretty shade of red, though. Not a shade that I would wear. That's too bright for me, but it is very pretty. Very pigmented. These bullets are super heavy duty. I mean, they're fantastic. The packaging is fantastic. I'm just not a fan of it. Um, this is... The Androgyny, what is this, the lip liner? This is the Androgyny lip liner. I don't remember if this is one that I like or don't like. Nope, this is one of the brown colors. I will never wear this, so that can go. I'm just not a brown nude person. It's just not me. This is Deceased. This is that gray purple color. This is ugly. It's like a nude gray purple. I will never wear that. Once again, it's not a me color. This is one of the glosses. This is Mouthful. This is one of the brown ones. We'll see if this is one of the ones that I will wear. I think this is one of the pinky browns. This might be one of the ones that I will wear. Yeah, this is a sheer, like, pinky brown, which I will wear. So, that is a me color. And it smells amazing. <laughs> that doesn't hurt either. So, there is that. Here is Magic Star. Oh, this is one. This is the concealer. Oh, sorry about how my nose is itching. Oh, dry from blowing my nose from this stupid cold too. <clears throat> so <laughs> if I can pop this puppy up out of here, it doesn't really look yellow though. Like that's the thing. Like when you look at it. These thing, these tops are a little over the top. I mean, the concealer is yellow, but I have a concealer that I can mix with that to make it look thing, but it really does not look yellow in person. But it says that it's pale yellow. So that I can use. <laughs> I think it's funny, this is the first time I've seen the concealers in the mystery boxes, so that's a that's an interesting thing to me. Let's see if I have anything else in here. I think I have one more thing. And this is the hoodie. with the spider on the back. I'm in love with this. Like, I like this. But I'm, I like spiders. Spiders are a very witchy thing to me. And I love it. It's very 
gothy, Halloweeny, just like edgy. I love this. Um, I also <laughs> find it funny. This now this is a two. This is a two X, and this thing is huge. So my my thing is is what I would love to know is when he makes the hoodies that go into the mystery boxes. Why are they, why are the two X's in there always huge compared to when I buy like one of your regular two X's? Cause I have noticed that when I buy a two X, it is remarkably smaller than when I buy a two X in the mystery box. Because, I mean, this is a 2X. Like, you can look at the tag. It is straight up. It is straight up a 2X. You can see that. It just says 2X. But, yeah, it is huge, like a 3X. I mean, it is ginormous. I mean, look at this. This is the shoulder. Like, I, <laughs> this is the shoulder area. Like, there's a... Th I'm like, that's huge. That is ginormous. Enormous, like I can wrap this around myself basically. So, the, I would love to know, like, why the sizes of your 2x's in your mystery boxes are um, more like a 3x in your regular stuff. I mean, do you are do you do the sizes extra big? I mean, what is the deal with that? Because this is more like this is likened more to a 3x. Uh, because I buy the actual Jeffree Star hoodies at 2X and they fit completely different. They're like a whole size smaller. It's insane. Like with the first one, like with the first one because it was my very first hoodie, I didn't think anything of it. But then when I started buying the regular 2X hoodies off the website, I noticed that I'm like, well, why are these smaller than my other ones? And then I get this one, and it says it's a 2X, but it's more like a 3X. So, oh well, it can shrink some. Not that they shrink very, they don't shrink. I tried that already with the other one, and they don't shrink. Instead, they're great. They make some roomy and comfy and warm, and I like baggy clothes. I hate tight-fitting clothes, so for me, it's awesome. Because I sleep in my hoodies. I'm terrible. <laughs> I sleep with the window open and the fan on and I close the vent so the heat cannot get in and sleep in my hoodies. But it's also, they're nice and warm, but they are also cotton, so. And the reason I buy his hoodies is because even though they're his hoodies, you're talking like 45, I would rather pay $45 for something that's cotton that I know is going to fit rather than going to someplace like Walmart <laughs> and getting something that's not cotton and doesn't fit. And I can't find anything I like. At least with his, I know I like them. So, everybody's like, why are you... <laughs> I literally had people <laughs> ask us why, why we have Jeffree Star hoodies, why we own them. And I'm like, uh, because I can. Why do you care? Why are you trying to look like a fat Justin Timberlake? Back in the 90s. 